Hi everyone, my name is Moti Freiman and I'm the director of the Computational MRI Lab at the Technion's Faculty of Biomedical Engineering. In the next few slides, I will introduce my lab and my research interest to you. Our lab is focusing on magnetic resonance imaging, which is an imaging technology that is used in clinical routine by hospitals to characterize human bodies. We can generate structural information, like the images you see on the top right panel of this slide, but we are also interested in generating functional information, characterizing the fiber tracts in the brain or the blood flow within the cardiac cycle, among other applications that we can use MRI for. Nowadays, MRI is used for, to assess brain structure and function, to assess cancer, to assess cardiac function, among other clinical, many other clinical applications. However, a lot of challenges are involved in acquire and analyze MRI data. The long acquisition time is a main bottleneck in utilization of MRI uh, in more clinical applications. The challenges involved in quantitative analysis of the MRI data extract the volumes of tumors assess structural and functional character, uh, characteristics of tissue are very important parameters that need to be extracted from the MRI data to be used clinically. Longitudinal analysis, comparing images of patients with cancer before and after treatment, assessing the efficacy of treatment, the progression of diseases are also important uh, uh, properties that need to be extracted from the MRI data all impose a lot of computational challenges in the data processing pipeline. Our goal in the lab is to leverage the modern deep learning technologies to extract the required information from the MRI data. Some ongoing projects that we have in our lab that leverage current deep learning and developing new deep learning technologies to characterize human body tissue by MRI involved characterization of the microscopic cellular architecture of the tissue with MRI through unsupervised Bayesian deep learning methods. We have some clinical applications to this novel technology we are developing, including assessment of Crohn's disease and assessment of fetal lung maturation. Other projects look on developing prediction scales to assess disease severity through deep learning regression models and through regularized autoencoders auto used for feature extraction. We have, again, clinical applications in Crohn's disease severity assessment, and this is an ongoing collaboration with the International Image Kid study. Other projects, including Bayesian unsupervised deep learning for image registration to enable motion robust MRI imaging and fetal imaging, also Crohn's disease assessment. If you are interested, you are welcome to contact us, contact us in this uh, uh, email or phone or through the QR code that we put on the slide. Our lab website is uh, listed here on the slide. You're welcome.